Welcome everyone to the Brundage Lift Ranking. Today I will be ranking each of the lifts from worst to best. Brundage is a ski resort located just 15 minutes from the historic town of McCall. With five chairlifts, Brundage Mountain offers a lot of skiable terrain. Let's rank the lifts from worst to best and tell you my opinions. Number five, Centennial Triple. Okay, now this lift is long. It starts all the way from the bottom of the bear chair lift and it's a base to summit lift and goes all the way up to near the top of the Bluebird Express lift. This lift is really long takes about 11 minute ride and honestly I think it needs to be a detachable. I tried to avoid this chair as much as possible due to long lines and a long ride time. Number 4 Easy Street Triple Chair Lift I put this lift a little bit higher on the list just because of the fact that even though it's a beginner lift and slows and stops so much the ride time is decently short and it's a great lift for lapping and honestly at the end of a tiring day this is a fun lift you just ride and take it easy. Number 3 Lakeview Triple Chair Now Lakeview is a really fun chair. It services Lakeview Bowl uh, with multiple blue and black runs. It's a great place to spend any time during the day, whether it's the afternoon or morning. The ride is super nice and relaxing. Uh, the lift ride is decently short, about six, five, six minutes. Um, definitely a good lift for lapping and the terrain it services is really good and just keep in mind, if you're ever thinking about going to this lift in the afternoon, it does close at 3.30 p.m. But overall, uh, Lakeview Triple is definitely one of my favorite lifts at Brundage. And I hope it lasts a long time as it is definitely one of the, one of the better lifts at Brundage. Number two. Bluebird Express Bluebird Express is definitely the most popular lift at Brundage. It starts at the base area where the main lodge is and goes all the way up to the summit. This lift services all of Brundage's terrain. Uh, it's a Gar Garvanta Stealth 2 4 person detachable quad chair and it's a really nice addition to the resort and this is pretty much a faster version of the lift i mentioned before or at the beginning of the video centennial this is definitely a faster version of it and i hope this lift will last as it is one of the best lifts at brundage also this lift does sometimes get crowded as it is the main out of base lift, especially on a Saturday. All the lifts at Brundage are good, but this is definitely one of my favorites. The speed is decent and sometimes I'll even catch it running at its full design speed of 1000 feet per minute. Also, another thing to keep in mind, this lift closes at four o'clock which is the same time that the resort closes. So if you're planning your trip to Brundage Mountain Resort, keep in mind that this lift does close at four o'clock, but somehow there is one other lift here at Brundage that manages to beat this one. Number one is, drum roll please, the bear chair. Now, this lift is fantastic, servicing some real nice mellow blue and green runs. 
I, I love going up this chair as I feel like I find and discover new things every time I do a run down this lift. Though the terrain pod that this lift services isn't the biggest, the lift still is amazing and I love it. Anyways guys, that is my lift ranking for Brundage Mountain. I really hope you guys enjoyed and let me know how I did in the comments and also let me know what your list would be of the lifts ranked here at Brundage Mountain. I hope to do more lift rankings at other resorts I ski at, such as Bogus Basin, Tamarack, and Sun Valley. Thank you guys for watching once again. Hope you enjoyed and this is Idaho Ski Lifts. Peacing out.